hey loves welcome back to my channel and if you're new welcome to my channel today's hair sponsor is by bmg girl hair um they sent over this beautiful unit that i'm about to show you guys right now um everything about this hair will be in the description bar down below and if you guys are interested in how i got the look in the intro then keep on watching this video okay you guys so this is gonna kind of be a quick install now i probably should have shown you guys um of me actually styling this wig but let me know in the comments down below if you guys want me to do um go more in depth and actually show you guys me styling and actually plucking the you know wigs and stuff like that so leave that in the comments down below but like i said i kind of already styled this i kind of already um flat iron it as well yeah i'm sorry that my lashes look like it only has like five in each eye it probably does but i'm probably gonna get a feel sometime soon or i'm probably just gonna take them off and take a break from them and y'all even my nails look a freaking mess don't even pay attention to them overall i'm just a mess but that's besides the point anyway so um like i said this is really gonna be a quick install because this is a closure i think this is a five by five I want to say five by five, but it's, it looked like it can also be a four by four. It might be a four by four, but um, the more accurate details will be in the description bar down below. So make sure you guys go check that out um, for the details. Now, this is how the wig look like. Now, I'm not sure what density. This is a again, check the description bar down below. This looked like it could be about 150. Yeah, about 150 density. So um, I haven't. I realized that I haven't really done like a straight wig in a while and I really um I've been doing like curly or curly or body wave wigs but I kind of want to start doing a little bit more straight now y'all already know I'm gonna go in into my ruby kisses cream foundation and I'm also in the um level 15 I use the darkest one in there if anybody was interested and then you guys already know I'm gonna just place it underneath here. Now I'm not sure if I'm gonna glue this on or not, or if I just might wear glueless. I might just wear a glueless because it's a closure and I don't really think I need to do anything special to it. Okay, so I'm gonna, like I said, I never really use the ones that are right here. I like to clip them together because like I said, this always makes it a little bit more tighter. Um, now, sometimes this does get uncomfortable because it does get really tight, but um, I would prefer it this way, especially if you're wearing this glueless, I would rather you um, clip them together because it does make it more sturdy and secure. You guys, I love when I um, do all the customization on the on the wig head first and then I just slap it on my head. I don't know, for some reason I would just prefer that than actually me doing styling it on my head. And that's mainly because, um, like imagine if I was flat ironing my hair, I wouldn't be able to get as, you know, as, how can I put this? I couldn't get like the back of my head and stuff like that so I would just prefer prefer to do all the styling on the mannequin head now uh, the ears right here are kind of giving me problems that's kind of what always happens when I get wigs like these um, sometimes the wigs just tend to be exactly on my ear but that's kind of how I gotta leave it Gonna brush her real quick. Gonna brush her. Like, don't worry, y'all. We're gonna get her together. Um, I wish I had some clips. Okay. So, we're gonna clip her back. Um, like I said, this wig is pretty sturdy, so I don't think I have to you know actually glue it down so what i am gonna do is just go in and just cut the 
all right y'all so i thought i was doing a voiceover but i guess not so right now what i am doing is i'm just going gonna go ahead and just cut off the lace um as you guys can see i am going in like a zigzag um up and down type of motion just to for the lace to not look like you know straight across my head and then i'm gonna go ahead and since i already plugged it in everything um all i literally have to do is just put in the baby hairs where i want them to go and honestly that's really the main thing that i really did to this wig i didn't really do anything like too too you know anything too serious on this wig because like i said this was glueless this is a very beginner friendly wig literally all you have to do is slap it on your head and well not slap it on your head and go because i did do some customization on it it's a very um beginner friendly wig so I'm going to go ahead and just, you know, do my baby hairs and stuff like that. You guys see me th do this like a thousand times. So I'm just going gonna, gonna to go ahead and do that. And then um, I guess I'll come back when I'm actually flowering my hair or um, fixing my part. But yeah. So I wanted to go ahead and cut um, just a little bit. I think that was like an inch and a half or two inches off the wig because it was very strangly and I didn't want that strangly look and I wanted it to be more even. So I did go ahead and just cut it off and then I am going to go ahead and bump the ends just to, I don't know, I just wanted to bump it and I kind of like the way that it looked bumped. So that's what we're going to do. All right, so you guys, my part don't look too, too bad, but I wanted it to be a little bit more um, defined. So I did go in with my concealer and then I just went in with my, what is that spray called? Black spray. And then I just went ahead and sprayed the part and it made a huge difference. I always like to do this. Even if your part looks good, it could be better. So um, if you guys are interested in that black spray, I'll probably leave it down below or um, just ask me and I'll, you know, put in the description bar down below for you guys. And then I finished it by putting some Tresemme hairspray and there we go. Okay, you guys, so this is the final look of um, how everything came together. Um, like I said, this wig was really easy to install. Like, honestly, if you have somewhere to go and you have no more than 
probably like 30, 35 minutes to an hour to you know have your hair ready to make it look like slay like you just came out of the salon then this hair would be like perfect for you to you know do quick and ready because like i said i didn't even do any type of installing literally all i did was plug and um plug and also bleach the knots and like i said those things don't take that long hence why i said 35 to an hour depending on how good you are with you know customizing your wigs and stuff like that like i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys like literally this this is a glueless unit like when i'm done i can slap it off as you guys can see like no glue like even my baby hairs aren't even glued down so like honestly this is like a perfect everyday wig as well like if you want to you know just be on the on the go but you're not someone that likes to keep hair on then this would be perfect for you because like i said you would be able to just you know put it on your head and go again this hair is from bmg i i believe if it is the wrong one then i'll probably correct it in the somewhere up here or um you guys can just check down below but this is from bmg girl hair um and i do believe this is a 24 inch yeah i do believe this is like a 24 inch and um i think it's in 150 percent density you guys i've been like kind of been wanting to do a straight wig because i know you guys been seeing me in a lot of you know body waves and curly hair and i and i realized and i'm like damn girl you never did a straight hair and i don't know i've been really been trying me and my friend was like damn i really want like a bust down the middle and this this is giving the girls what it needs to give so let me know in the comments down below what you guys think of this hair what you guys think of this look um i would say makeup but child my makeup always looks the same and let me know if you guys want me to do like a updated makeup tutorial because uh, i've been getting like messages and stuff of you guys saying for me to do that so let me know and also i do i did cut off the ends a little bit and i did um just gave them a little bump this way i don't know i kind of like the look of it you know fitting in the um inside inwards whatever but um but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video um thank you bmg for sending me this um cute little unit everything will be in the description bar down below if you guys are interested in this everyday quick um quick wig um i hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure you guys like comment and subscribe and i'll see you loves in the next one bye